I'm Dr. Katherine Burns. I'm an orthopedic surgeon at SSM Health Medical Group. I'm board certified in orthopedics and sports medicine, and I have a subspecialty interest in shoulder. So probably 80% or more of my elective practice is devoted to patients with shoulder problems. I want my patients to understand that I'm technically skilled, technically qualified, board certified, and that's generally gonna be true of almost any surgeon that you see. But what makes a difference at SSM is that I really try to take the time to listen to my patients, to hear what they're saying, to understand what their problem is, why they're coming to see me. In the past, we had shoulder replacement would put a ball in a socket to replace a damaged shoulder joint, but it really had some limitations. In the last two decades, there's been a reverse shoulder replacement now available for patients in the United States. And the reverse shoulder replacement is still a full ball and socket, but where the ball and socket are, are flipped. So the ball is placed where the socket is and the socket's placed where the ball is. And when you do that, it really does some amazing things. So one thing that it does is it adds stability to the shoulder joint. So people who have instability or other issues in addition to their arthritis can benefit. The other thing it does is allow other muscles around the shoulder to do some of the job for the rotator cuff. Over time, rotator cuff tears can become not repairable. And when that happens, we used to kind of hit the end of the road. But with reverse shoulder replacement, it allows you to treat those patients who have really massive rotator cuff tears that are simply not repairable. And often will allow people who can't lift their arm to lift their arm again. It really can just restore a lot of options for people who are really limited by shoulder problems. One of the reasons that I like working for SSM is not just because it's a good work environment for me. I also think it provides a lot of benefit for my patient. So one of the things that I think is amazing about SSM is the ability to kind of seamlessly integrate across disciplines, uh, the ability to access imaging. I have a great rapport with my radiologist, so I can give them a call, talk to them if I have questions or concerns. It's really uh, just a collegial environment to practice, so I really like that. But it's also good for my patients because it makes a difference to them when I'm able to talk to their other doctors. It makes a difference to them when all of the staff are working for the same place and have kind of the same goals and the same ideas. 